So, you're looking for a new awesome text effect for your picture. That's great, because today I'll show you how to create this extremely simple text through object effect. Let's open up Photoshop. First, you want to import your picture into the project. Once that's done, go to the layer panel. Now select the picture and duplicate it by pressing Ctrl plus J on your keyboard. Next, with the duplicated layer selected, go to the select menu on top. Find choose subject. This way Photoshop will create a selection around the subject or in this case, this person. Next, once the selection has been made, click on the mask layer button. This will remove the background and make sure only the subject is visible. Of course, we can still see the background because the duplicate is still visible on the bottom. There you go. Next, go to the toolbar and click the text tool. Click somewhere in your canvas and type in your word. When you're done, hit Ctrl plus T on your keyboard to scale and position it to your liking. When that's done, go back to the layer panel and find the text layer. Right click it and choose convert to smart object. Now drag it in between both your pictures so that the text is sitting behind your subject. Next, we're gonna duplicate the text layer by hitting Ctrl plus J again. Then drag the duplicate on top of all the layers. Next, we're gonna make the insides of the text layer visible. And to do that, set the fill opacity to 0% by dragging it. Now, double click the text layer to open up the layer styles. Find the stroke style and turn it on. Then create a subtle stroke like this. Now, click the color picker to choose a color for your stroke. This can be the same one as your text fill color, but definitely experiment with other colors as well. When you're done, click on OK. That looks awesome already. Next, we're going to create a clipping mask from the stroke text. To do that, hold down Alt on your keyboard and click in between the text layer and your top image. Now the top text layer will only work on this image. To finish it off, we're going to link both the text layers so that we can move them around. Hold down Ctrl on your keyboard and select both the layers. Then on the bottom, click the link button. Now in your canvas, you can move around and adjust your text layer however you want. Next, we're going to learn how to blend the text with objects in your picture. So to continue the lesson, click the video on my left. Thank you guys so much for watching and as always, stay creative.